everyone. So I'm going to show you now how to do the Talgo brush cleanse. So this is what you would do in your treatments when you're doing facial. So what you need are your cleansing brushes and your gentle cleansing milk. And in here I've got about six, seven pumps of the gentle cleansing milk that I've heated up in the hot cabbie. So what we're going to do, now normally you would have um, done your discovery of the sea, cleanse the eyes and lips. So to do the actual brush cleanse, what we're going to do, you're going to take on your brushes about 80% of your gentle cleansing milk. So leave a little bit in the bowl. Always just get in the habit of um, checking the temperature of the product on your wrist before you put it onto the client's skin. And we're going to do our application first. So first of all, you're going to apply across the decollete and then you're going to come up the neck, around to the middle between the eyebrows and then down the edges of the face, back down to the shoulders. The first movement is our decollete. So you're going to take one brush over to the other, slide across and circle on the shoulder. And you're going to do that with alternate hands and it's six times all together, three with each hand. I think that's four. <laughs> to do the neck, you're going to start on one side and you're gonna go brush over brush all the way across and then all the way back coming down. So it's up, down and then if you can, try and keep at least one of the brushes in contact all of the time, just to make the experience more smooth for the client. The next movement is our chin circles. So we're coming under and over the chin. I think that's six all together. When we've done circles on the chin, we're then going to do circles around the eyes. So with both brushes together, we're doing a figure of eight, around the eyes three times. And you'll know you're going in the right direction um, if you're going in the direction of the eyebrow hair growth. Then on one side of the face, we're doing outward sweeping movement, movements from the middle outwards, working up the face and then on the forehead. When we've done one side, we're going to do the other. So starting from the chin, working outwards, cheek working outwards, and then the temple working upwards. To finish, we're going to do a big effleurage back down, and then we're going to do another big effleurage up like we did at the beginning, and finish at the temples. You would then take out, the, out of your bowl the rest of your cleansing milk, onto your hands and you're going to do a manual cleanse then and this is going to give you um, a chance just to get in around the nose or any of the areas that the brushes might have missed. To remove the cleanser you're going to take a lovely warm Oshibari that's been in the cabbie. Again just check the temperature. You're going to check the temperature on the client as well, make sure it's not too hot for them. Roll it across the decollete and do a pressure with both hands and some lovely circles, this feels really, really nice. Hold the edges of your Oshibari and sweep the neck side to side, removing the cleanser from the neck. Then you're going to bring the edges of your Oshibari together at the forehead and you're gonna do a pressure on the cheeks and then a pressure on the chin and the forehead. And then working downwards, going to cleanse the face, remove the cleanser from the face. You can then turn your Oshibri around so that it's clean and you can make a little mitt with your hand and remove the rest of the cleanser. You would then follow with your toner and continue with your treatment. I hope that's been helpful.